Welcome to Longevity's Welding Channel. I'm Tim Roble, and today I'm happy to announce a brand new machine. It's the Pro MTS 200. MTS, that's right, you guessed it. MIG, TIG, and STICK, all in one little lightweight, easy to use package. This machine comes pre-wired with a 220 plug already set up and ready to go. As you can see, I have the MIG, the TIG, and the ground all set up on this machine and ready to weld. Let me take you through the setup. The MTS comes standard with this very nice MIG gun. That is a Euro Connect, so hooking this up is a snap. Simply you'll just insert this in, line it up, and screw it down. Hooking up the TIG torch is also a snap. TIG torch gets installed on the negative side. You just give it a twist, lock it down. This is a little three pin for your torch trigger, and you'll just simply line this up and push it in place. This will be your gas for your argon flow on the TIG process. It's a nice brass fitting so we'll just take it and give it a nice little snug down and that'll be good to go. We're supplied with a very nice ground, once again high spring tension, copper lined, clips to your workpiece or to your welding table, and then we'll simply Install the ground on the positive side and lock her down. The MTS comes standard with the WP-17 air-cooled torch. We'll simply take the air-cooled collet body, screw this in. I've installed some 2% lanthanated tungsten on my 332nd collet. I'll drop this down. Since I do have a large piece of tungsten, I'll install the large top. Screw that down. And then I'll take a number six cup and install that. That's pretty much it for building the torch. It comes with everything you see here except for tungsten. It has a torch trigger that works in both 2T and 4T modes. And then this is a new little item on the torch and it allows you to adjust your argon flow while you're actually welding. And for the stick process we have the new type stinger that allows multiple different configurations for holding your electrode. Located on the back is the power switch. Turn that to on. You'll notice that the quiet running high efficiency cooling fan comes on. Right now we're in a stick mode on the upper left hand corner so we just push this one more time. Now we go to MIG one more time down in the stick and back to TIG mode. We have both 2T and 4T. We have our amps that we can tune in. This is a DC only machine, but it's also capable of welding aluminum on the MIG side. There's an optional spool gun available for this unit, so it makes this very, very versatile. In the MIG mode, we have iron, aluminum, stainless steel. You can run through this machine, and then we have our different thicknesses that we can dial in for the unit. We have a waveform that we can change basically the welding characteristic on the TIG mode. And then this in the stick mode actually works as arc force and in the MIG mode it works for your wire speed for tuning that in. I'm super excited about this new unit. 200 amps, DC only, IGBT technology and a full Synergic design. What Synergic is, is it utilizes a small microprocessor in the unit that works in conjunction with the hardware to give you an optimum weld puddle. What I really like is this MIG process and the TIG process can stay hooked up at the same time and it's just a simple push of the button to switch between the two. What I really like about that is I might be over trying to hold apart and manipulate it into, into place and now I can use the MIG function and just come through and tack some things up remove the part, bring it back to the table, and now I can switch over to a TIG process and weld it up with an award-winning weld. Also, being a DC only, we would think that would exclude aluminum, but there is an optional spool gun available for this unit uh, to weld aluminum, and it's also set up to do stainless steel. So very versatile, very easy to use, very easy to understand. Stay tuned for future episodes where we'll cover using this machine in action and we'll do some head-to-head -head tests. Thank you for watching Longevity's Welding Channel. I'm Tim Roll, and I'll catch you here next time.